Hello, Divine Collective. Welcome or welcome back to my channel, Divine Goddess Enlightenment. I'm Ashley, and I am here with a channel, Divine Investigations, for you guys. As you guys come in, don't forget to subscribe if you aren't already. I hope you guys are having a fabulous afternoon. I'm doing well. So, Divine Collective, I do have a Divine Investigations, um, a channel message. And this is in regards to a sibling rivalry I was picking up on. Okay, it's a sibling um, that I feel like you've got some type of clarity on um, in regards to this person having this type of some secret vendetta against you, see, like some type of uh, hatred towards you. And I feel like this is something you always intuitively picked up on in your childhood as well, but um, you can never really put your finger on it. And like, you know, you're the type of person you never wanted to believe that your siblings or the people closest to you really had this underlying hate, this underlying vendetta, this secret vendetta. I picked up the energy of Cain and Abel, uh, the two, two brothers that, you know, they both made sacrifices to the Most High, but God favored Abel more. And in a jealous rage, Cain killed Abel, his brother, dude, because of, of the, the underlying bitter hate and jealousy he had towards his brother just because of God, God's favor over uh, Abel's life, okay? So I'm um, picking up the initial C and A could be highly significant to this uh, divine investigation. And I feel like that's what makes this sibling rivalry so dangerous. That's what made it so dangerous is because this sibling... Uh, have this secret vendetta. They never really show or told you how they, the true intentions they have for you, how they really felt about you, the hate they really had. It was hidden this whole time. This is what makes it so dangerous. I'm picking up on a very jealous, uh, bitter individual, someone that, uh, would, I feel like will let jealousy drive them to try to harm you, to try to hurt you. Okay, and I feel like this sibling did a lot in your childhood, did a lot in the past period to cause harm, to cause endings, okay, to secretly behind the scenes plot and go against you. I also picked up with this sibling, this may not resonate for all you, but for some of my chosen ones here, this sibling and a karmic mother work together for years behind the scenes in order to target and plot on you. OK, and I feel like this is uh, you got some type of some floor of clarity, some form of clarity about this. OK, they work together. Uh, this sibling, I feel like work with karmic family. They work with other family members to cause stagnation and burdens and, and to end something. OK, I feel like your survival, the way you've outwitted this sibling and everyone that came against you offend, offends this sibling, okay? Because this sibling worked behind the scenes to cause endings, okay? To target you, to plot against you. And they are highly offended because you surpassed them in life. You have transformed. You have leveled up. You have come into this, this uh, sense of self-mastery, okay? And this sibling... Is someone that's still stuck in a dark depths, that's still stuck in the same place you leveled up from, and they're highly envious, they're highly bitter that you, out of out of all like your your siblings, you are the one that transformed, leveled up, and, and self mastered. Okay, you became you the one who became in alignment and stepped into your purpose. All right. Uh, I was picking up like with this sibling, it was like, it was always this love hate relationship. You, I feel like in childhood for some of you, it was, it was a rocky relationship with this sibling. Okay. Sometimes you guys got along. Sometimes you guys were warring and beefing with each other. And, um, like I said, it is, I picked up on love hate for some of you though. I picked up on like this sibling always admired you and looked up to you, but it turned into a deep seated resentment and hate. Because of your the quality qualities you possess, okay. So, like I said, it was a love hate relationship. This sibling ultimately looked up to you, but resented you for your strength, your confidence, and your level of resilience and perseverance, and your uh, and the way you overcame adversities, life challenges. I feel like this energy, this sibling, is someone um, 
very weak in spirit, okay? I feel like this sibling doesn't possess the divine strength you have, doesn't possess the, the self-assurance, the, the confidence, okay? Your ability to overcome everything sent to destroy you, okay? This person could have never uh, um, accomplished the things you've accomplished on this journey, okay? And... um. I feel like this sibling wanted you to dim your light. Your light make this sibling uncomfortable. They always try to find ways to um, downplay you or to make you feel isolated. And I was picking up, too, with this karmic mother. This karmic mother and this sibling uh, went through great lengths to make you feel isolated, okay, to, to single you out, to make you feel unwanted, to make you not feel worthy or a part uh, of this dynamic, okay? Uh, I picked up the energy, this karmic sister. I'm seeing like the uh, uh, Queen of Wands in reverse. Leo Sash Aries energy is very significant. But this is someone very insecure. This is someone very bitter. Okay. This is someone that, uh, someone that doesn't have the security or the confidence that you, you've always possessed. This is someone that has struggled with insecurities, that has struggled with, um, with just not feeling, you know, not not being in a power. Someone that, that struggled with feel, feeling weak, feeling defeated, okay? Feeling like a failure in life, all right? And like I said, this person is very insecure because of the qualities you possess. You're someone very confident. You you speak your mind very bold. You have a lot of book and street smarts, okay? You've always been someone with a lot of wisdom. You've always been a go-to person. You've always carried this light within. You've always been gifted. And this person has always been very insecure. I feel like this person has a low self-esteem and always uh, were, was bitter at, at the amount of strength and confidence. Even when you were going through your storm, you was going through your struggle, you still made that shit look beautiful, okay? You still made it look beautiful, okay? And um, like I said, since childhood... This this uh, sibling has been secretly envious of you and had this secret vendetta against you. And that's what makes this so dangerous because this was hidden. This was someone very deceptive, someone that smiled in your face, someone that act like they love you. It was all fake love. Someone that, that uh, really was this trickster energy and painted this illusion as, as if they were someone that loved you, that supported you, that cared for you. But in the background, behind the scenes, they, they were always highly extremely envious bitter all right jealous and bothered just bothered okay and you closed out a cycle with this sibling this sibling is no longer in your energy you no longer have any ties with this sibling this was the karmic sibling that you had a soul contract with okay and you've re you've released yourself from this toxic relationship this toxic sibling dynamic and like i said Unbeknownst to you, this person, it always been a sibling rivalry. You are never, you can never see it though, okay? You can never see it because you was too busy showing love. You was too busy being genuine. You was too busy being that real authentic sibling. You never would have thought in a million years that this sibling had this much hate for you and uh, worked so hard to dim your light. And I picked up the energy. This is someone very untrustworthy. This sibling is someone very much untrustworthy. We got the tower at the bottom of the deck. This is Scorpio energy. I'm picking up on a Scorpio. This sibling could be a Scorpio, like I said. With this tower here, this sibling work behind the scenes with another person, another family member, take it where it resonates to cause some type of endings out of jealousy. Because like I said, this is a Cain and Abel situation. God, you the chosen seed that was that was uh, born in this family full of karmics, all right? And this sibling had this deep-seated hate for you because of the favor and a spiritual anointing on your life, period. We got look, y'all. We got judgment right here. This sibling is being judged, okay? This sibling is being judged, all right? Because like I said, unbeknownst to you, behind the scenes, this sibling did, did so, so much foul shit, so much 
uh, sent you so many attacks, okay, to try to cause a tower moment in your life. And like I said, this this uh, sibling is very envious and bitter of your resilience, okay, your resilience and how you persevere through through the attacks. You persevere through the storm, through the life challenges, okay. This person is bothered as fuck. Someone very untrustworthy. I feel like you, this is the type of energy you could you couldn't touch around your children. Okay, this person had that much hate for you, that that much envy for you. Okay, that it it uh it resulted over into the relationship they have with your children. If you have any children, all right. But this is a very this is someone very untrustworthy. This is someone that really played in your face for years, as if they were loving. They nurtured you as if they care for you. Okay. Spirit guides to the highest white light as I tap into the energies of this divine investigation. I ask that you give me clear channel messages. I also ask that you protect me as I open myself to different energies. Thank you, Ashe. The five of wands just flipped over. Okay. Like I said, this is this is rivalry energy. Okay. I feel like this sibling always was in some type of secret competition with you. Even this 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 stems from childhood. All right, growing up, this was unbeknownst to you, but spirit has confirmed who this sibling, the part this sibling played. This was a karmic that you were spiritually contracted to clear some type of karmic debt. And this is someone that always had this, uh, like this was in some type of secret competition with you. This is someone that's very, like I said, very insecure, highly insecure and conflicted with themselves. Okay. <clears throat> What's the energy spirit? For my divine ones in regards to this divine investigation. What's the energy? Yeah, this rivalry stems from childhood with this page of pentacles. You could be an earth sign. Okay. As you can see, this sibling all, always had this vendetta against you. This sibling always felt the need to compete with you, okay? Because since childhood, all right, it, you 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 were you are you are the able, okay? You you are the one God favors. God has anointed, all right, since childhood, all right, and then always this this sibling always been conflicted. OK, I feel like, too, this sibling could have played as some type of doppelganger, someone that imitated you a lot. Someone, like I said, love, hate. They have this deep seated hate, but they 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 admire your strength, your abilities, your power, your uh, self-assurance, uh, admire your how confident and secure you are within yourself. All right. But it grew into this resentment. It grew into this deep seated hate because you see how he got that pinnacle, how God favors you. You are held in high honor. OK. You could be starting something new, some type of new project. You could be studying some type of uh, a new subject. You could be reading a lot of books, getting a lot of enlightenment at this time. With this three of pentacles here. OK, I feel like I feel like uh, this sibling, this sibling is ultimately heartbroken. OK, because the illusions have been broken. OK, what, what was hidden and you see that those two wolves or dogs right there. This is Pisces cancer energy. All right. This sibling worked together with others to, to and the shadows. OK, to cause some type of grief to you. OK. I feel like this is someone broken. This sibling really is someone who hasn't spiritually evolved, who haven't done any shadow work, who haven't done any healing. And they have projected their energy onto you for so long, okay? A lot of projection. This person wanted you to feel part, the heartbreak, the pain, the grief that they feel, that they felt, okay? This person this person is uh, has always been intimidated of you, intimidated of your strength, all right? Like I said, with this moon card here too, you've you've got spirit shows you you got some type of clarity, all right? Some type of clarity about it's something significant that happened in your childhood with this sibling, okay? Like I said, I feel like you and this sibling argued a lot, you fought with this sibling a, a lot, and this was because of this uh, this secret, this deep seated secret envy and hate, okay? We got a Queen of Swords here. I can't look with your perseverance. I know that I could do whatever I put my mind to. 
All right. Like I said, this sibling, this sibling has always envied and, resent, and resented your perseverance and how you're someone, you're very strong. All right. You're very strong. You're, you're very, uh, you're, you, you have this warrior like spirit. Okay. It, it's your strength. I'm really getting at this. This sibling has always been intimidated at your strength and how you were able to defeat things sent to destroy you, how you were able to, uh, to manifest your way out of endings that was, that was intentionally brought onto you by this sibling and by whoever this person is that this sibling secretly behind the scenes worked against you with. Yes, you surrendered these family members, okay? You surrendered this sibling. You no longer have ties with this sibling. Something has ended. This uh, this contract has came to a close, okay? Upon you awakening to the truth. Like I said, you could be a Leo here. Your It's your courage. It's your strength. It's your confidence. It's your resilience, okay? You have, it's your inner strength. You, you have the inner strength to face fear with confidence, Period. What's the energy spirit? As a matter of fact, let's get what's uh clarify the five of wands spirit. Clarify the five of wands. Clarify the five of wands. I feel like this uh yeah. Look, I feel like this sibling ultimately betrayed you in some type of way to intentionally cause some type of heartbreak. Okay. And like I said, this was dangerous. This was, this was a dangerous sibling rivalry because this was all hidden. All right. The hate, the jealousy, this was all hidden. But with this three of swords, I do pick up on some type of betrayal. This could have been a sibling that betrayed you with someone you had some type of emotional connection to. All right. And with the Ten of Cups, the Ten of Cups clarifying the Five of Wands here. OK, like I said, for a lot of you, this this sibling teamed up with other family members. OK, teamed up with other family members to come against you, to come against you. This this person always had the, these envious, bitter feelings towards you. OK, this person never really took a, a liking to you. And they, this person recruited others to go against you. And for a, a lot of you, it's your whole family with this Ten of Cups, okay? I feel like in this family dynamic, all right, upon, like, this sibling and the people they work with, these family members they work with, to cause some type of, cause some type of grief, cause some type of edit, okay? It's a lot of conflict going on with this within this family dynamic. This is a very toxic family. I feel like it's a lot of arguments, a lot of fights, because every everything has back, backfired. Okay, this sibling, this 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 sibling has uh has caused a lot of conf conflict and chaos. Clarify the moon card spirit and they're in regret. Clarify the moon card spirit. Clarify the moon card spirit. Clarify the moon card spirit. Clarify the moon card. You picked up on this hate in childhood with this six of cups that just flipped over. Six of cups. Yeah. I can't make this up, y'all. This sibling has secretly had this vendetta against you since childhood. Okay, this stems all the way back from your childhood. Maybe you were favored by your grandmother, an auntie. You were favored by uh, a grandpa, an uncle. Take it where it resonates. But it's always it's, it's always been a secret, deep seated hate for you. Clarify the moon spirit and assist the cup. <laughs> yeah, you got some type of you got some type of download, some type of message in regards to, in regards to the sibling rivalry. OK, and like I said, you did the page. Of wines, this is a divine messenger. All right. 
This this sibling has always resented you because of the position God gave you as the chosen one, as this divine spiritual messenger. Okay. And it always this it is it's it's always been secretly hated. But like I picked up, this person secretly admired your strength. This person secretly admired your confidence, your resilience, okay? I can't make this up. <laughs> With the strength card here, Leo energy. I'm picking up on big Leo energy, okay? This person always, always, this person, like I said, they were admired at one point. This sibling looked up to you. The sibling admired you. The sibling Im imitated you a lot. Wanted to be just like you. But it all, it all, uh, it all boiled down to resentment. It all like it, it exuded into hate. This love turned into hate. This love turned into some type of infatuation, some type of obsession to stop you. Okay, the sibling always worried about you outranking them, you outdoing them in life, you surpassing them in life, and that's what exactly what you, what you done. That's why this sibling is so conflicted right now. Okay, and like I said, for a long time since childhood, unbeknownst to you, because you were you were under some type of illusion. You were under some type of illusion. You could have seven seven siblings. Okay, you were inside and you were in some type of illusion that this this sibling. Was uh the sibling was always operating out of they out of uh they they lower self always operating in its dark uh low vibrational energy okay but these were this was someone that 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 was a sibling okay someone that you would have never thought that had this hate for you you did you couldn't see the hate because you was too busy showing love you was too busy being real being authentic being supportive being there. OK, I feel like you really had love for this sibling and it really hurts you. It really disappoints you to learn how this sibling always truly felt about you. OK. Ten of Pentacles energy, like I said, the favor, the favor. And this is family energy again. Ted, Ted is significant. October 10th is significant. OK. You could have been born on the 10th, uh, the 10th, 10th day of the month. All right. But it's always been your favor, all right? And this sibling is really pressed because of this, this glow up, this transformation you have undergone, this spiritual transformation, okay? This, uh, I feel like if this sibling did the shadow work, if, if they did the work, okay, and, uh, and invested this time in themselves instead of investing, investing in daytime to cause you conflict, to cause you grief, okay, they will be further on in life, all right? They would be further on in life. You did the work. You invested in yourself. This sibling was invested. It was invested, all right, throughout your whole childhood to, to cause you some type of pain, all right, to betray you in some type of way. I do pick up on a, on a betrayal, okay? You have, you have turned, like I said, you detach. You turned your back from this sibling. You no longer have, have a soul tie to this, this individual because you woke up out the illusion and you now know who, the, who they are. And they know who the fuck you are. They always knew it. The favor, the anointing. God always have on your life, okay? You've, you've been born this natural healer with natural abilities. You could be an Aquarius, okay? You've, you always, look, I will not dim my light to make, make you feel comfortable, all right? This particular sibling one, worked hard to try to make you dim your light, to fuck with your self-esteem, fuck with your confidence, okay? Because your light bothers their demons and expose the, their insecurities. Yeah, like I said, like I said, you've leveled up. You've you've surpassed this sibling, okay? The sibling feel like a failure. They feel like they failed that life. They feel like you're superior, okay? All right, because you've have stepped into this new season. All right, you transform. You spiritually upgraded. You transform. All right, you you you're you're stepping into the most abundant season of your life. And I do feel like this sibling feel is heartbroken because they can't share they can't share this moment with you. They was too busy sent, uh, competing with you. They was too busy sending you hate, and they regret this shit. All right, they regret it. They regret it. 
all right? And with this, this Knight of Cups, this sibling could try to come in, try to gaslight you, try to come in and try to... Uh, try to uh be on some reminiscent type shit nah fuck that i remember when you fucking attacked me because you you grew jealous of the favor i had on my life i remember when you were secretly working against me no okay this person may want to try to make a small offer try to get back in your good graces because of where you're going okay but because you made it you have offers coming to you. This person is, is uh, mentally, this person is in a mental prison. Okay. Like I said, they, they're unhealed. They did, they did not do the shadow work. They didn't do the work on themselves. They was too busy trying to cause havoc and, and, and bring you down. Okay. Now this person, this person feels mentally con constricted, stuck. Okay. Yeah, because you got the enlightenment. Virgo energy here, you got the enlightenment. This person feel conflicted because you know who they are. They, the mass has fallen. They have been exposed for who they are. All right? They can no longer play in your energy. Okay? This person is very intimidated of, of, of your, your, the wisdom and knowledge you hold. All right? Very enlightened. You're spiritually enlightened. Okay? And yeah. Yeah, this is a queen of swords energy. Like I said, you speak your mind. You bold. You spoke your mind and you cut these motherfuckers off. You don't want anything to do with this sibling, okay? This was a dangerous sibling rivalry because they always secretly had this envy and hate for you. But it has been revealed, okay? It has been revealed. I love you guys. Till the next video. Peace.